say you're right. I was really working. There was a, there was a possibility. No, no, there. she's saying yes. She's no, in. we gotta work you're in. It's easy. Table. The last thing I want to do is go on TV and dance again. At least we try to do cats. You wouldn't be a dance. You'd be like a judge or something. Yes. See? They're using. We know how to work these things in. You have goddamn doctor in front of your name, and they're the ones using their brains. They're the creative geniuses. Yeah. They are. Yeah. I could be like, like, or like the the, the mean geniuses. punk that comes around and like tries to like impose his ways, and they're like, they're like, we better not hang out oh, with. Or from like the opposing cheerleaders. Yeah. Yeah. But they didn't have to dance for that, right? No. Have to dance. No, no, no. No, no, no. You just wear like a, you just wear like a cheerleading uniform. She's not a cheerleader in it. No. No, I used to be. I think I used to be. You're like a rebel. I was, I was like legendary in the '90s for like my my cheerleading. And now you're like a pole vaulter. And I'm over it now, but but. But I, I wear berets and I'm still like you know like in the scene people know me they bow down yeah. to me and but you see right berets. through me you see right I through fall me for you. underneath it all well, I think you try to break up the squat I think you cause drama that's right because yeah. underneath it all I'm very timid and very insecure and right. I, but, I, you but, see some but most importantly you're likable yeah, yeah. <laughs> and your name is Lil Puss and Puss <laughs> you go by with a beret which is weird I, just thinking what that, that we, somewhere we're going to see some, some tumbling and that patented move Dr. Drew, really, it's so funny. That Dr. Wait, is there a patented move that yes. you do? By the way, hold, hold on. on. What, what is this? Why did you get kicked off so early? Let me, let me explain to you what Dr. Drew's trying to do. Did somebody yeah. trip you? It, this is deep. This is a okay. very deep psychological thing that Dr. Drew does. It's because hard on you. Dr. Drew is an incredibly supportive guy, especially to me. He, he, is, he is caring. He does everything he can to yeah. further my life in every facet, it, yeah. be it professionally, personally. He does everything. He can. But in some weird way, he also likes to sabotage it. Right. Because he knows that me doing my patented move, by the way, which is me trying to suck my own wiener... That's what it is. That's your move? Yes. Wow. What? It freaks out female guests, and Dr. Drew insists that I do it. No, wait a minute. I don't insist. It seems to happen. Dr. Uh, Drew, have a, tonight, I mentioned I've insisted. It, uh, Dr. Drew, have I mentioned it once tonight? No. no you tonight, have four tonight. times tonight. tonight. It's true every time. Dr. Drew, every Dr. Time. Dr. Drew, Anderson, come here. Every single time, it's huge. But Drew loves repetition. I think that's the thing with, with Drew. He loves things to happen over and over and over again. Yeah. And I think it's probably because he's a doctor. It and that's is. what they do in medical school. He has a scientific mind, yeah. and everything has to happen oh. in your own little yeah. system. Yeah. It has to have no, reason. No, wait a minute. Yeah. Now, uh, on Dancing with the Stars, is this what got you kicked off because no. you did this? No, that was, that was the... Dancing with the Stars is that I'm a terrible dancer. But then but then the... He don't Rick. He don't Rick. Almost I got you reinstated. Yeah, It's true. It's true. Listen... None of this is important. What's important is Tuesday night, this Tuesday night, yeah. tomorrow night here on the West Coast, 9 p.m. CW, new episode of Hellcats. Both the ladies will be on. John, hello. 